Hey guys, Yvette here and I am the Witch of Willow Creek and today is day 29 of hashtag 29 days of tarot, 29 tarot spreads in 29 days and I still didn't get it right on the 29th day, damn it. Uh, brought to you by myself and Dior at Divination and 29 candles of February brought to you by Chris over at Slip the Trap. And today I thought I'd do uh, just a fun spread. I thought I'd do the Star Wars spread because I found it in the book. I did not know that there was a Star Wars spread in the book. And so that's what we're doing. So, and I've, this is, I've tried. I tried keeping it under 15 minutes, guys. I, I couldn't. So the candle is lit as always for all those who need it. And I don't think I've said it in the other videos, but it is. It's in it. Y'all see it there. It's lit. And, um, my other candle just turned off over there in the corner. But yeah, let's start with number one. And number one, the first question was, what is the force? And for that, I got the five of water. Oh, sorry for the glare. I got the five of water. And before I couldn't read what was going on in the book, but now we can because apparently I can't get my shit together under 15 minutes. So five of water. So what is, what is the force? The force is the five of water. Five of cups. I feel the, fulf the fulfillness of my emotions as they wash through me. So the force is emotion, is a feeling, right? It's a feeling that courses through you. That is what the force is. Number two, what energy courses through me? Apparently the five of cups, right? But we got the four of air. <laughs> the four of air. And that is Let's see if we can get to it. Let's get to it. Four of air. Healing, meditation, rest, recuperation. So, because that's the four swords, right? So, yeah. So, the power, the, 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 what energy courses through me is the energy of calm and peacefulness. That's what kind of energy courses through me. So, number three. How can I train myself to be more sensitive to my power? And for that, we got the four of fire. So the four of fire, of course, is the four, is the party card, the uh, four of wands, right? So, but, which has also come out a lot lately for us here. And in this deck, it says a new creative phase, celebration, pleasure, and harmony in relationships. And the question is, how can I train myself to be more sensitive to my power? And to be more sensitive to my power is to have pleasure and harmony and celebrating that power. Like embracing my power instead of just, instead of ignoring it or, you know, fearing it you know, or, you know, anybody, anybody who has this, who has a power and you want to nurture it, you got to accept it and work with it. So, yeah. So number four is what creates a disturbance in my force? And for that, I got the wheel of the fortune, the fortune's wheel, which is the wheel of fortune. And that is what creates a disturbance in my force. So, and then that's understandable because the, the wheel turns and turns, right? And where it stops, nobody knows. Uh, destiny meets synchronicity. I am in awe to experience many meaningful coincidences that proved to me that spirit has my back. And that's for me is 
the disturbance is sudden changes in routines and stuff. Like I don't mind changing my routine, but if I'm, let's say that we're going to, let's go have dinner somewhere, right? And then you decide it and I'm dressed for, that's what I'm dressed for. You pull up and say, no, there's a change of plans. We're going to go scuba diving. Well, for fuck's sake, why didn't you tell me that before you got here so I could have changed, right? <laughs> so, and then, of course, I'll go and change or whatever and just do it, right? But still, I mean, that little, it takes me a little bit to adjust. So, you know, little disturbances like that. That kind of shit, okay? <laughs> Um, am I tempted by the dark side? Am I tempted by, that's number five. Am I tempted by the dark side? And we got strength. I am not easily tempted by the dark side. But you guys know if you got some chocolate chip cookies. Just saying, just saying. <laughs> but as uh, so a while... I'm not easily tempted by the dark side. I think I pretty much can dance side by side with the dark side. So, who knows? But according to this, I am not easily tempted. Number six, how do I filter emotions like fear? Number six, and here we go again with the eight of air. You know, clarity truth this is number six right how do i f filter emotions like fear yeah by gaining knowledge of the truth and being and being you know get, gaining clarity of the situation that's how i filter fear number seven can can I use my force for compassion? And we got the seven of fire. That's a unicorn. Seven of fire. And I didn't, I didn't read the eight of uh, era because that's come up for us several times now. Okay. So seven of fire. Personal best. Uh, I am un unstoppable. My passion pushes obstacles aside as I engage in situations situ sustained <laughs> as I engage in s sustained effort. Damn. Can't read today. I know how to bend out. Oh, how to bend out. How to bend, but I don't compromise. So it's kind of like what I was saying earlier. But the problem is I do compromise. I mean, I do I do know when to compromise, when it's a good time to compromise and when it isn't. On what's most important to me. That's true. I don't. If it's important to me, I'm going to fight you to a no. Tooth and nail for that situation because it's my belief. It's what I believe. You know? But can I use it for compassion? Yes. Because I release the temptations and challenges. So, so Yes. Yes, and I guess it all depends because it is the seven of wands. And I guess it all depends on whether or not. I mean, I sometimes can and I sometimes can't. And it all depends on the situation, right? Number eight, what is the destiny of my, what is the destiny I must fulfill? The destiny I must fulfill is the sun. The sun is my destiny. So let's read that. We all know the sun is hunky dory and just wonderful and all that kind of chisnet. But let's see what this deck has to say about the sun. If I can find the sun. Let's see, where is the sun? Oh, hello, it's numbered. Why am I not even looking at the damn numbers? Get it together, girl. Okay, here's the sun abundance so my destiny what is the destiny i must fulfill 
because we are very in abundance, right? At this time, everything is possible and everything I need to know is illuminated. Projects come to fruition, relationships flourish, and my growth is assured. This is a time of plenty. It's important that I share this abundance with others. I am deeply grateful. So that is pretty much my goal in life is to, my destiny is to live in the sun card without the, without the naked baby, obviously. Okay. I think everybody's destiny, everybody wants to be abundant, right? Everybody wants to share, have enough to share with others. I mean, whose goal? Nobody wants to live a shitty life. Nobody's goal is to live a shitty life, right? <laughs> I'm just saying. This was day 29 of hashtag 29 days of 29 trail spreads of 29 days and hashtag 29 candles of February. I really enjoyed this uh, tag. I really enjoyed everybody else, watching everybody else who joined us. And I'm really happy for those who also joined us and did, didn't, you know, did this on their own at home. Um, I hope that you guys, it's helped you guys. It's actually helped me. Um, and I've also started another, it's another challenge that's not, not going to be video because it's a personal challenge in tarot. So, but yeah, I thoroughly enjoy doing this with D over at Divination and we are going to do another one in April. So stay tuned for that. It's not uh, going to be a um, tarot one, but it is going to be a witchy one. Um, I think we're doing that because I, I need to have a break for moving and stuff. So hopefully, um, hopefully my move is sooner rather than later. And if it's in April, then I'm not sure how I'm going to be doing the challenge, how I'm going to do it. But, um, I guess I will have that conversation with her if that happens. And that's pretty much it, guys. Oh, I also want to thank the, all my new subscribers. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Um, so happy that you, you know, feel a connection enough to my, you know, my content to join me and everyone here and the, or everyone here at the creek. So don't be afraid to post a comment and to, you know chime in when you want to and somebody's always messing with my stuff again somebody's moved that and yesterday i was telling you know d that i could feel a hand on my shoulder so anywho and there's nobody there anywho guys i will see you guys in the next video bye guys